Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to this walkthrough of To the Moon. This is Blackjack Kent, and we are following Johnny's earliest memories as a wee lad. Where we are going to try and influence him to go to the moon. We're hanging out at a carnival with him and his brother and his mom. That can't be the smallest Ferris wheel in the world. I just rode in a four-seater last... The world's smallest Ferris wheel, everybody. Come see and be awed. Okay, then. Uh... Anything else to click on around here? <coughs> Hello? I need more memories. I never understand you, Joey. How can you stand the taste of them? They're just so sour and icky. Sour and awesome is what you mean. Just try it. This is the pickled olives. No, I don't even want to taste regular olives. You should try at least one, Johnny. Who knows? Maybe you'll like it. Uh, yeah. Mwah. I'm done, though. Can I go play? Okay, but only at the playground and not an inch too far. Just leave that bag. I'll keep it for you. No, it's mine. I want it. Receive note. Pickled olives. Johnny's favorite. Joey's favorite, by the sound of it. And then Johnny started trying to be Joey. Poor guy. Requires five bars of memory likes to proceed. Did I miss something back here? Hello? Oh. What up? What is this? Why do I care? <laughs> Can't find out what these like specifically refer to. That's frustrating. Alright, off we go. Johnny! I much prefer the playground. The music is much less obnoxious here. I think we will stay here. Sup, Johnny? Where are you going? You were not supposed to leave the playground. What are you doing, Johnny? <laughs> Way to follow Mom's orders, huh? Alright, Johnny, where are we off to? Where are we going, pal? What's up? <laughs> okay. Wow. Pretty. Is this where Johnny decided he wanted to go to the moon? Whoa. Okay. Well, okay, so he wandered off the trail and found a cool place. But let's say that he could have also been eaten by a pack of tigers. Tigers don't travel in packs, idiot. It was just an expression. You know, when I was a kid, my grandpa took me stargazing every year. Yeah? There was a hill outside the city that we'd stay at. Same one every year. We'd watch the stars till daybreak. Well, I did mostly. He just carried the telescope for me. Of course. <laughs> the thing was, though, Ma didn't want me to stay up late. Grandpa always told her that we were just camping and hid the telescope inside the car. That's all good, but when we got back in the morning, I had to pretend like I'd actually slept. So in conclusion, that's the story of how I started my caffeine addiction. <laughs> oh, Watts. You're terrible. I know. It's a shame, though. 
what, that he's terrible? I agree. All these nice memories lost and never found. And who knows how many more like it. Well, as you say, just take it moment for moment, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. I told you packs of tigers dwell here. Uh, hello? Is it River? <laughs> Hi, River. I think it's River. Hello? Wait, don't go. I'm Johnny. What's your name? You're at my spot. Your spot. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hog this place all to myself. Um, you wanna join me? Are you here to watch the stars? Are you? <laughs> Aww. Freaking choked up. This is adorable. Aww. <laughs> Just look at him. Did you know there were so many lights in the sky? Yes. Oh, uh, I did too. You said this was your spot, right? Only during the carnival. Not a fan of the crowds? Me neither. You know, you still haven't told me your name yet. I'm not telling you. Everyone makes fun of it in school. Why? They say it makes them want to go to the washroom. <laughs> uh, okay then. Well, it can't be worse than John. I mean, everywhere in the world, nearly everyone's named John. Even in India? Probably. What's wrong with that? Huh? What's wrong with having a name that everyone has? Well, it's boring, I guess. I mean, if everyone has it, then what's the point? I wouldn't mind. Just for once, to have the same name everyone else has. It's like those lights in the sky. They all look the same from here, but that doesn't make them any less pretty. Yeah, I suppose. What do you think those stars up there are anyways? My dad said they're giant burning spheres of gas. Oh, I bet he's just making it up. Why would he lie to me? Because, you know, that's what grown-ups do. They make things up. Santa, Easter Bunny, kangaroos, stuff like that. Have you ever made an Easter Bunny out of stars? Like a constellation? Yes. Um, of other things. Never tried a rabbit, though. Do you want to make one? Yeah, we'll make the best constellation ever. Let's see who makes one out first. Okay, we'll start in three. Three, two, one, and I see it. Uh, where? <laughs> in the sky. Um, but where in the sky? Think big. Uh, bigger than all the others. I don't know. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I see it. Tell me what you see. There, right? There are the two ears and the head. What else? And there... There's his two feet. Yes, what else? And, and the moon. The moon is its big round belly. <laughs> I'm not actually choked up, I have a cold, but that was adorable. So what do you think they really are? The stars, I mean. 
I, I've never told anyone, but I've always thought they were lighthouses. Billions of lighthouses, stuck at the far end of the sky. Wow, it must be so lively up there. But it isn't. They can see all the other lighthouses out there. And they want to talk to them. But they can't because they're all too far apart to hear what the others are saying. All they can do is shine their lights from afar. So that's what they do. They shine their lights at the other lighthouses. And at me. Why you? Because one day, I'm going to befriend one of them. That bag, what's in it? Oh, it's the prize I won from Whack-A-Mole. Did you get to play that game? I tried, but I'm too clumsy. What'd you get from it? I got a thing. I don't really know what it is. <laughs> the platypus. It's some kind of a weird duck beaver thing. May I see it? It looks so strange. I wish I could win one myself. Johnny! Eek! That's Ma calling. Here. You know what? Keep it. It's yours. Mine. Yeah, I can always get another. I don't like to brag, but I'm totally the best at that game. Will you be here next year? Yep. Will you? Yes. Same place, same time? Yes. <laughs> what if you forget, or get lost? Then we can always regroup on the moon, silly. Right on the rabbit's tummy. Johnny! Coming! Oh yeah, I forgot my hacky sack in the bag. You said you're clumsy, right? Maybe it'll help. get lost. Wait, does that mean... Don't tell me you didn't see that coming. And here I thought this was going to be an inspirational childhood dream story. I should have known, <laughs> should have known that some girl would come along and turn it into a cheese fest. I suppose now we know what we must do to send him to the moon. Wait, you aren't actually going to do it, are you? It's our job, Neil. It's what we're contracted to do. Damn it, Eva, wait. Eva. What are we doing exactly? I know you're in here. Receive note, moon. Oh, so we have to prevent them from getting together? Is that what's going on? I'm confused. Objective, where Johnny and River are to regroup if they got lost from each other. This is all your fault. What? Stuffed toy platypus. Doing? Johnny, where you at, bro? I'm doing this for you, you artificially generated bastard. What am I doing? The music got really dramatic, you guys. I'm sort of stressing out. Is this where I'm supposed to go? I don't know what I'm doing. music is so dramatic. Yo, Eva. Turn around. Neil. I know what you're planning to do. I know that you know. Yeah, well I know that you... Look, our contract is to send him to the moon. 
And the only way for that to happen is if Johnny is motivated to do so. But if that means removing River, then what's the point? The reason why he even wants to go to the moon in the first place is because she died. I know, but we're legally bound by the contract, and specifically- Fuck the contract! I didn't take this job to make him miserable, Eva. I don't know about you, but I sign up to help the freaking geezers die happy. Me too, and I like this job. But if we directly go against our legal obligations, we'd be in for court hearings. We'll appeal. We know that Johnny'd be happier to not go to the moon. Johnny would be happier with a lot of alternate life tangents, Neil. We're not here to play God. Our job is to give him what he signed for. Well, we happen to know what he wants better than he does. Look, I'm only risking losing River because I believe in her, and... What do you mean, risk? You're removing her. And besides, I'll make up for it. Make up for it how? We're running out of time. Just trust me. Says the one who pushed me off the fucking lighthouse. Oh shit. Oh shit. Did you just... Freaking light data. Abusing your powers doesn't disable my controls entirely, Eva. Whoa, what? Booby traps? Really, Eva? Just trying to buy some time. Gee, thanks for telling me. Oh, okay, what? Wow, that's inconvenient. Okay, what? Okay. This is a new little minigame going on here. Ow! Asshole! There's some expensive pieces of equipment you're tossing. Seriously, just stay put and wait till I'm done. Oh, piss off. God damn it, Eva. I don't mind you doing this, but I mind you changing the controls up on me all of a sudden. Look, don't make me exit this whole thing and unplug you. Would you really risk distorting his memories as they are? Just stop trying, please. This won't take long. Ugh, not again. Or come and find me at the end of the hall. Oh, okay, now I can use the mouse again. Oh, nope. Alright, fuck it. Eva, you're making this really fucking difficult. What? Oh, you've got to be freaking Is this a joke to you, Eva? Dear Lord, they aren't just zombie Evas. They're zombievas. <laughs> Don't come any closer, I got plants. WASD on the keyboard to shoot. Okay, that was easy. Whoops. Hold on. Oh, for crying out loud. This is frustrating. Get out of my face. Ah, uh, Eva. Eva, you're weird. Okay, these controls are weirding me out. Ava, get out of my face! Get out of my face! There we go. Alright, that was a pain in the ass. Ah! No. What up? Bros and sisses? Is this even where I'm supposed to be? Phew, these things are good for something after all. Ow! Walk on. Walk on, pal. Damn it! Oh, okay, that's right. I can hear it. There we go. There we go. Too many keys all of a sudden. This was not part of the plan. Eva. Like, I get what you're doing, sort of, but this is really fucking stressful. Also, I just walked in a circle. Yes. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? What is even happening? Oh, hello. Is this, am I doing what I'm supposed to be doing here? I'm definitely walking in a circle here. Uh, hang on a second. I'm gonna figure this out and I'll, uh, I'll, uh, uh, be back when I figure it out. This whole thing is just a loop. Oh, okay. That was easy. Now what? Oh, fuck this. <laughs> what the? 
This is all getting very dramatic. Isn't this where I just was? Damn it, Eva. Eva, what happened? Eva? Eva! Now I want to watch Wally again. Yo! Whoa! <laughs> what? What is going... What else? Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far end of the sky. Now the whole construct's messed up. Two rivers at once. Okay. Oop. <laughs> it's finished, River. She won't be alone anymore. Pickled olives. I just don't want to be another typical kid in a sea of typical people, Nick. What is it like? Just the responsibilities, I suppose. I don't remember all of these conversations. This is getting very trippy, you guys. Eva, what the fuck are you doing? Whoa, okay. <laughs> oh, Johnny, I'm so sorry. Well, you totally fucked your brain up. Emperor's new clothes. It says I can click on that, but I'm not doing anything when I click on it. Uh, moving on. Oop, okay. Hello! Wait, don't go. I'm Johnny, what's your name? Your spot? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hog this place off for myself. Johnny, what's your name? Yeah, okay. Uh, this is all very feelsy and stressful. <coughs> Oop. That way. Look, it was a long time ago. There's no date or time, Johnny. I think I'm supposed to remember all of these conversations, but I'm not really remembering all of them. What is this? Oh, good. Hello? Neil? Morpheus? What? It's Eva, you idiot. No shit, we're the only ones here. Listen, whatever you've been doing, stop it. We might not know what Johnny wants, but we know what he doesn't want, and what he doesn't want is exactly what you're accelerating. It's already done, Neil. Why don't you come out now? Hey, Eva, what up? <laughs> what did you do to her? Relax, she's merely going elsewhere. <laughs> you know, it's one thing to disable my controls to feed me some olives. This is way out of line. I'm sorry, but this just won't go anywhere if you keep on resetting the memory. At this point, this is the only way. I'm asking you to trust me. So please, just calm down and wait here. And just pull the trigger already. Where are you going? There's just one last thing I need to do. Poser, there's no need to visualize a door. What's with all this melodrama, Neil? Why are you fighting so hard for- oh shit, I didn't see what it- 
the last one. Forget it, there's no time. Was it for her, for him? Love and everything will be alright, man. Just turn around. Okay. Okay. Hey, what are you shh? Um, hello. Sorry, kid. It's already started. <laughs> 